we're back once again. Squashing buttons here, voice of wrestling.com, youtube.com slash voices of wrestling, voice of wrestling.com slash YouTube as well. All that good stuff. All the good stuff. It's myself, Rich, along with John. Hello. Still playing WrestleMania 2000 here. So oh, yeah, um, I'm excited. We did part one. I did an exhibition match where I beat the hell out of Jim Ross for about three minutes. Right. And we talked about our history and, and a little bit of background on, on you and I. Uh, we left off. The teaser was Giant Throbbing Cock. Giant uh, Throbbing Cock. So for people that just jumped into it, that was good, is it? Uh, yeah, that was see, good. You that's, like that's, that? that's, that's why, why you're an international voiceover that, superstar right. right there. North America. <laughs> now, you're just, now you're just doing North America. Parts of Canada. But it's on YouTube, and YouTube can be accessed internationally. That's true. So that's true. Like this thing. I mean, we're international YouTube superstars right now. That's true. And you have been before. I have been before. And still are, technically. I mean, once you're in it, you're in it. Right? right? Yeah, it's like the fucking mafia. You know, <laughs> once you're a YouTuber. Once, once you're, a gent, you're a gent all the way. Once you're <laughs> exactly. a YouTuber, you're a toxic fan base follower. So anyway, we were talking about your voiceover work and how you... Uh-huh. Um, uh, there was a, uh, what was it, a gay uh, erotic novel uh, that somebody uh, wanted you, or an yes. e-book, yeah, they wanted you to uh, Yeah, a gay erotic audiobook. Uh, I got an offer <clears throat> for it. I didn't, I didn't audition, um, but, you know, some people might think, I'm just going to do an exhibition, but I'm going to choose. Right. We're going, we're going main stage, baby, all right? Oh, wow. Yeah, WrestleMania. It's better be a big match then. I, I, I don't know what you have planned, but. It's going to be D-Lo Brown <laughs> versus X-Pac. Type- <laughs> D-Lo Brown. No, I mean, yeah. For the Mr. Easy title? No. Okay. Right. Uh, <laughs> no. No. Non-title match <laughs> okay. at, All right. at WrestleMania All right. is the way we're going to do it. Uh, uh, the, the, the Mr. No. Easy title doesn't just get, just get thrown no, around I gotta all over beat, the place. I got to beat the shit out of out of Mr. McMahon. So okay. who's going to do? Who's going to get to do it? Why don't you bring your creator Russell? Let's see what he's got. All right. All right. Let's we'll see do, what he, Let's we'll, see what we'll, the move set is. We'll yeah. go with. We'll go with. Well, uh, there's Nemesis too. I like these two. So you got six six two seventy five. <laughs> two six six two seventy five. That's uh, you know that's that's a big man. Right. That is a large human being. It looks just like you. I see why you did it. Yeah. Right? The, the, yes. The long hair, the tattoos, the <laughs> muscles, and, <laughs> and giving the finger to everybody. That's, right. That is that's pretty how well. I operate. Yeah. Pretty good. Nemesis is a little it's bit bigger. Seven feet, 11 <laughs> inches tall. At 346, though, that's kind of light, right? If you were 7'11, yeah. I, wouldn't that be pretty? Like, I feel like you're a minimum, like, 400 pounds. Like, like you Yao can't Ming, not be 400 pounds. What was Yao Ming? Yao Ming was 7'2, 7'4? Yeah, and he was about 340, I think. Okay. But he was sticks. I mean, he he. Every time he jumped, he's, his body right. fell apart. So three forty six so. is a little light. A little for, light for being. But Nemesis doesn't 11. look light, and he's got the elbow pads. Right. Case, how so. can you get right? And how you can walk <laughs> at seven feet eleven inches tall? <laughs> how your knees just don't. Right. I don't. I don't know. But the- I will show you the greatness that I that I had. Uh, oh, I like the alternative. Oh no no no. Uh, oh yeah. yeah actually, hold on. Actually, hold on. Actually, no 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 no. There's a shirtless version. Oh, okay. That. Yeah, there it yeah. is. And he's going to beat the shit out of Mr. McMahon. Okay. Because nobody likes Mr. McMahon. Well, let's see what we got here because we weren't sure about the bloodshed. Okay, yeah. there is bloodshed. No uh, time limit, no ring out. Okay. I what like about this. DQ? DQ or. Uh, Where is it? Uh, I, apparently, I don't see it. Okay. Don't worry so, about it. I guess there's none. <laughs> I so, guess, I don't know awesome. What, so, it's a hardcore match. I guess every match is a hardcore. Is yeah, that always how it's been? I don't know. I pff, don't remember. So, in case you haven't seen, we have no idea what we're doing here. We're just doing exhibition, uh, exhibition matches while we while we shoot the shit here for a little bit. And then we'll uh, we'll go into the career mode a little bit and do this. But it's, it's not a hardcore Let's Play. If you're looking for us to, like, break down WrestleMania 2000, that's probably not going to happen. You're listening no. for us. There, there's, a, there's other places on the internet that probably do that way right. better than we ever could. Well, yeah, but... I forgot how tall he was. <laughs> okay, unlike you, I forgot how to play. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. You're gonna right. get it. That's light fine. strike, light strike, light grapple, and then you just oh, gotta power go moves. with these. I hope this guy is straight. Oh, that's oh, a great yes. clothesline. Yeah. I like how he's like a pseudo. Uh, he's like a half blend of like he's got a little Hulk Hogan in him, you know. Oh yeah, and then he does the cane. I always love this cane punch. Yes, that yeah, little, yeah. That little where he rears back in the uppercut. So oh, anyway, and the Yakuza kick. Got it. Yeah, because great why? for Royal Rumbles, by the way. <laughs> yes. Nemesis uh, is going to be hard to beat in the Royal Rumbles with the Yakuza kick. That's well, if I can figure out how to fucking do anything with him again, <laughs> because I, like, believe me, I took him all the way and rolled to WrestleMania. I mean, it was it was fucking. All right, you got that Mr. Easy title. Oh come uh, on! I, the timing. The timing all is off. yeah. That's if the you watch my thing too. Off. Yeah, we're, we're we're not quite there timing wise yet, but so we'll, we'll get there. Back to the big ass throbbing. Cog. Yes, yeah. I, I don't know how we cannot. You know, it's not. I didn't audition, and I didn't. I didn't go <laughs> after it. Yes, he did. <laughs> yes, he just the did. Kick, yes. <laughs> Uh, he's an agile 7-Eleven. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh god, the Yakuza kick is the best. <laughs> All right, and then from the outside, from yeah, let's top see rope to Probably the outside. Right? Okay, okay, that's, no, that's pretty meager. Yeah. And Vince, Vince to the outside. He had the yeah. he had the wherewithal to, to know to roll out of the way. 
but I don't I didn't not take the job I didn't go after it not because of the content yeah it doesn't have to do with the content or anything like that it's just not that there's anything wrong with that right no 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 it's I'm sure it's it's greatly written I mean I mean all audiobooks well listen when you're talking about audiobooks how good is the writing or excuse me erotic novels right, right. how good is the writing really uh, I don't read a whole lot of them, but somebody on if if you're if you're listening to this or watching this, please let us know if you're uh, right. If you are, if you're a frequent, uh, if you're like I erotic, love, I love. Oh come on, just do it to the outside. Heterosexual, oh, homosexual, either one, whatever. Bisexual, no, it doesn't, whatever. It doesn't we don't matter. Care. My my point is, it's, it it transcends the badness of erotic novels. Transcends sexuality. Right. It tra- it transcends. You know, cis, trans, gay, straight, bi, whatever you want. It's they're all bad, and. The reason I didn't take it was because I've read bad scripts before. Oh, shit. Vince, right. Vince, Vince, is, K. Vince, is, Vince, not, K. Vince is not doing bad here. He had the training montage just like he did before he, he uh, faced Royal Rumble. Stone Cold that one time. The Royal Rumble, 1999, yeah. yeah. Where he just he went after. He, he chased the chicken with uh, Shane. Right, and then he... Uh, he like stunned like fifteen guys in a row or <laughs> yeah, whatever just, it was. Uh, random or, jobbers at the yeah, WF training, training in. facility, yeah. Uh, working out in the sweet WF gym. Right. And like the terrible neon lights still <laughs> around it. <laughs> and I've again I've read I've read bad scripts yeah. before. I've read scripts where guys it's like it's clearly English is not your first language. <laughs> and Do you want me to edit this? No? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> but it's like you gotta you gotta understand that when you're recording an audiobook, all right, how do I pick up again? I forget. Uh, I believe it's right, uh, the right, right bumper, okay. yeah. It's By like, the way, the first few videos are us gonna, just going to be us figuring it out. Right. We don't want to take remember. Oh, go out. to the pin. No, All fuck right. that. Let's let that go. No, <laughs> we're not we're not checking them right just yet. Um, when you record an audiobook, when you record hours of audio uh-huh. on end, each hour, each finished hour takes like four. Yeah. Oh, okay. In the studio and in the thing. And I just don't. Do they pay th- comparable? To- and that's the thing. It was a two-parter, the reason why. The one was. I didn't know how long I could spend <laughs> reading erotic. Right, reading and editing, because because you know you spend an hour talking about whatever it is. Again, gay right. straight giant doesn't matter. Cocks or, Jobbing, yeah. th- giant throbbing cocks or, or or you know members going into <laughs> the shake oh, rattle yeah, and roll. The the shake, rattle, rattle and roll. Uh, yes. you, you spend an hour in the booth talking about that, but it's really four hours of in the booth editing, right, right. and it's just like, listen, I love giant throbbing cocks and big gigantic. Huge Rest. areolas. Yeah, and, yeah. And I love them as much as the next guy, but for four hours, and the the book was like seven hours of audio is what they oh, wanted. Oh wow! And I'm just like, no. <laughs> thanks for no. No, thanks, I don't. Yeah. Th- I don't think so. I'm not going to do it. And also, on top of that, they wanted seven hours of audio, and they were like, yeah, seven hundred dollars will be. No, it won't. Well, yeah, <laughs> yeah and I'm like. No, no, it, it'll be... It not, will, not when you're talking to an international voiceover superstar. Right. When you're talking to, you know, when you're talking to a kid who just got his first, you know, like, USB Logitech desktop right. microphone, and he's like, I'm going to be a voiceover star. And it's like, all right, bro, you go do the audiobook for seven hours and $700, because I'm not going to right. reverse that shit. Fuck you, McMahon. Bam! Oh, I've never nice seen, move. I've never seen anybody do that move before. Do they uh, do that? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I, I, yeah, there's, there's quite a few that do it. Now, I've got the special. I don't remember a special. Yeah, we're going to find out. That's the oh, best God. part. That's why we had to play Get this. the fuck back up, Nemesis, because <laughs> the su- special only lasts for a little bit. And it's the stutter. It's the okay, stutter. Okay. okay, because of course it's yeah, the stutter. Yeah, you got to do the, the back. The back. Oh, you don't have time. It's all right. And I do the crotch trap, yeah, and yeah. I just... I pin, and then he pin. <laughs> I pin Vincent K. McMahon. One, He's kicking out. two, two, okay. three. No, nope. all the way through. So... Suffice it to say, if you and hear somebody the, doing an audiobook, oh, and he does the cane. Yeah, of course. Or the, or, I like Nemesis. Nemesis is a solid. Nemesis is, he's grounded. Know. I thought he'd be way uh, more insane. Like all, all like all oh, the seven foot eleven. You'll buy. You'll buy seven eleven. That's fine. But the move set, I, I was, and we talked about it on, on part one that like my creative guys were always like seven foot three. Right. But then they did like flipping planches to the outside and like I, no, I guarantee suicide you, dives. I guarantee you, in his move set, there are that. I just forgot how to. Okay. Do <laughs> just, I, just, I, I just don't, don't know, know how to do them. So, do but you're you're good at seven eleven. You're you're fine That's with okay. seven feet eleven inches tall, <laughs> three hundred and forty six pounds. Yes. But 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 you will not have. You will not condone. That guy doing swanton bombs. That's no, it's unrealistic. Okay, the same. It's just the, unrealistic. At that point, you lost me. Yeah, yeah. You got me. 7 Eleven, cool. Right. 346. I, I did mention that that was a little unrealistic, right. but he could be skinny. I mean, he doesn't look skinny, but you, you never know. I mean, he could be missing. Right, he could be he lean. Could be a prosthetic he could, leg he could be or very something. lean or something. Right. Right. A prosthetic leg. I, I don't know that. <laughs> it could be a, so he's wrestling on a prosthetic yeah, leg. Yeah, I don't know. 7 Eleven, <laughs> one of his knees is holding up all of his body weight. <laughs> but. <laughs> 
but that's, that's fine. That's fine. But a fucking swanton off the top is ridiculous. When you're seven feet eleven, I, okay, I get the it. The back heel it. kick was ridiculous. The back heel kick, right? So this. What were you thinking as a child? I, I don't <laughs> John, what were you thinking? I don't know. I don't. I don't. I don't remember. What but was eleven year old you thinking? Like? I don't remember. But you know what I was thinking was when I first created my first guy, yeah. and they, they had a choice of you could go all the way up uh, to seven feet eleven, yeah, or you could be question marks. Okay, you could. I yeah. did not know that. You could be question okay. marks tall, and, and there were three different classes of question marks. One oh, really it was short. Tall, yeah. yeah, tall. Okay. And then I, but like I was for so parts much, unknown. If you're like a guy from parts unknown or right. whatever, yeah, you're like a demonic. But for some reason, the the tallest question mark guy uh-huh. is still shorter than seven okay. feet eleven. Because he's just shrouded in mystery. He's not necessarily like a gigantic tall dude. Right. He's just from parts unknown. Like he's. He could be African, you know. Usually they would have that, you know, Kamal. If you're right, Kamal, right. they're like, we don't know. I mean, right, you're gonna get this guy to scale. Look at him; he's a weirdo. He doesn't wear <laughs> shoes. Like, that's a WF trope. Is like uh-huh. Africans and Samoans—they never wear shoes. Like these fucking savages <laughs> from these other lands. Because <laughs> American Samoa is just this <laughs> shoeless <laughs> weirdos hitting each other with coconuts. Their right. foreheads are are hard. You can't hurt them. And also crime time. And that's, crime time. And yes. crime time. Right. It's because- they wore shoes and they stole shoes too. But. <laughs> Crime time. What was your favorite crime time memory? Just the whole bit. Because you are a wrestling. Not to. Not to the. You're not the hardcore. Like there's gonna be people listening. You're not that level. No, I think. I think the people. Listen, if you're like, if you stay up until 3 a.m. to watch Japanese wrestling, you're a fucking weirdo. I'm sorry. What are you trying to say? I'm just saying. That's just. That's. I don't do it that often. That is unrealistic. Okay, I'll okay. buy seven foot eleven swan time. What about because I, I can't do that often? I will watch it in the morning. Then the next morning. That's fine. You know, with your so with that's your fine. Cheerios. With your Cheerios. Honey nut. Of course. Apple cinnamon? You mix the two together, you got yourself a goddamn I cereal. I do that all the friend. time. Okay. Yes. <laughs> do you do that? Apple cinnamon is it's apple underrated. Cinnamon, no, a- apple it's cinnamon underrated, is, but far a- superior Apple cinnamon is, is top notch. Right. I don't trust anybody who eats normal Cheerios. Right? No, it's weird. Because you got multigrain. Fantastic. Do you okay. Have, have you ever had those? I have had multigrain. Like they have the Olympic ones that come out the right. Olympic season yeah, or yeah. whatever. Apple cinnamon, fantastic. We should Honey just, nut, great. Why don't we just review Cheerios on this stupid? Why are we playing video games? Why there's there's video, but it's just <laughs> the, the end replay. <laughs> We're not constantly. Doing, why are you watching this? I don't what know. What are you doing? But yeah. People? What are you doing? Tell Rich we should do a podcast instead of just video. Yeah, that's that true. way it would make it easier for me to not have all this set up. <laughs> but um, but no, if you just eat regular Cheerios, and I'm just kidding about the staying up till three in the morning to watch Japanese wrestling. That's really cool that you care that much. Yeah. about the thing, especially Rich. I know you do it, and I know your buddy Joe. Yeah, oh yeah. You guys work your ass off to Voice make yeah. to make VoiceOfWrestling.com great. But if you just eat regular Cheerios, that th- is unrealistic. Unrealistic, and you're you're just a fucking weirdo. Well, that'll let us go for part two. We're we'll gonna come back part three. Uh, I think is it time we start Road to WrestleMania? Do you want to do Road to Wrestling? Should we, or do we create just, a wrestler? Because that's going to be like a 35 That's going to arduous. That's like an arduous. Like, because I have you ever, if you remember going back to the moves. Oh, yeah. I, I would know. spend that, like, oh, all, I would like wake time. up on a Saturday, eat my apple cinnamon Cheerios, and then that was it. That was my day activity. Your day like, was. I cannot wait. Well, I can't. No, not today. I'm not going outside. Not going outside. Not going like to you to the grocery store. No, no, I'm not no, going with you to the grocery store to read wrestling magazines, which I used to do all the time. No. Well, that's fine too. I am doing this and then so that tomorrow sunday okay so we're gonna I can go play for the rest of the night saturday we will be creating a wrestler <laughs> and then sunday, then saturday and then s- right and then sleep i'll come over. back tomorrow no or sleep, sleep over. over okay and then you, you could sleep on arkham's at the bed. dog bed yeah yeah i mean he, for him he's only I. peed on it a couple times i don't care and i have washed it i sleep and pee pretty much i have two dogs so okay the, all right the so the there you go. sleep thing is not a problem for me all right so and then tomorrow we will begin the role to wrestlemania <laughs> okay. or we could just start it with a created wrestler <laughs> that's true nemesis and or lefty anyway we'll be back part three start a road to wrestlemania i'm rich for john Say bye to the, the weird people on the other end. See you later, weird people. We'll take you next time. <laughs> Peace out. Anyway, voiceofwrestling.com slash YouTube. YouTube.com slash voice wrestling. Anyway, you want to do it. Also, our Amazon WWE Shop affiliate, voiceofwrestling.com slash Amazon. Voiceofwrestling.com slash WWE Shop. We'll be right back on Squashy Buttons, Voice of Wrestling. Take care.